dear. Here, if you would try out your um, your audio visual, that would be great. Thank you. Check in audio. Wonderful. We can hear you. Charmaine, if you would go ahead and um, unmute and um, try out your your video, that would be wonderful. Hi there. Wonderful. Hi, Charlene. How are you? Good. Um, and Donna, are you able to hear or are you, um, I see that you're unmuted, so I just want to see if we can hear you. Unfortunately, um, we're not able to hear you. And Raphael, I just wanted to let you know um, that all members of the board, with the exception of Vern, well, are present at the moment. Oh, is Todd so, on, on, on the call too? I'm sorry, what? Is Todd? Um, oh, uh, oh, I'm sorry. I, I feel terrible. No, Todd is not on the call. I apologize. Oh, he, okay. He, he's there. He's, Todd's here. Yeah, I think we, well, we have a quorum. Um, if, if you could wait just one moment. Um, Todd, if you would go ahead and test out your audio and video, please. Okay, can you hear me now? <laughs> we can. All right, here, let me get the video going here. Yeah, it was weird. It, was, it wasn't showing. I couldn't see myself on here. So, but it's working now, so. <laughs> Hey, Todd. Hey. Okay, I'm going to call the meeting to order. Eileen? Yes, okay. Uh, go right ahead. All right, so there's uh, something that I need to read now that we are doing the meeting uh, through this uh, platform. So uh, due to the provisions of the governor's executive orders and dash 25 dash 20 and and dash 29 dash 20, which suspend certain requirements of the Brown Act and the order of the health officer of the county of Sonoma to shelter in place to minimize the spread of COVID-19, SRTV, the SRTV board will be conducting today's meeting in a virtual setting using the Zoom webinar. The uh, board members and staff are participating from remote locations and are or and or part pra practicing uh, appropriate social distancing. Sorry, members of the public may view and listen to the meeting as noted on the city's website and as noted on the agenda. Members of the public wishing to speak during item three, public comment or during our public hearing items will be able to do so by utilizing the raise hand feature, um, uh, feature their hand or pressing star nine on their phone. I thought it was uh, star six, but anyway, they then give, uh, will be given the ability to address the, the board. 
Um, okay, so thank you. Uh, now I move on to uh, um, the roll call. Oh yes, roll call. If everybody could Perfect. please announce your name and the organization that you're uh, affiliated with. Thank you. You, um, you know what, Rafael, I'm going to just go through and I'll just confirm who, who's present. Um, so members Rivero, Anderson, Renteria, and Rumble are all present, as well as um, member Calkins. Um, not present is Vern LaCosta. Great, thank you, thank you. Okay, so now on the agenda, we move on to public comments, and this is a time, uh, an opportunity for uh, members of the public to uh, make public comments. There are no raised hands at this time. All right, thank you. All right, moving on quickly to item three. We have a couple of minutes to approve. We're gonna begin with the, uh, the approval of the uh, draft meeting minutes uh, for our June 18th, 2020 meeting. Um, I'd like to uh, make a motion to uh, approve those minutes. I'll second. Okay. Okay. Um, so all in favor of approving the uh, June 18th, 2020 uh, meeting minutes, uh, say aye. Aye. Okay, any opposed? Minutes approved. Following uh, our agenda, item 3.2, it's the uh, approval of draft meeting minutes for our September 24th, 2020 meeting. It was a very brief meeting. And um, if I could have a motion to approve those minutes, please. So moved. Okay. Uh, anyone? Second. Uh, I'll second. Okay, Todd. Okay, all those in favor of approving the September twenty fourth, twenty twenty meeting minutes, say aye. 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 Okay. Thank you. Any opposed? Okay. So minutes approved. Thank you all very much. All right. Moving on down our agenda. Uh, I Actually, don't. Rafael, Rafael yes. I'm I'm sorry to interrupt you. Um, if you need to just ask for public comments. Um, oh, as part of your new business. Thank you. Yes. Yeah. Uh, any any uh, comments, uh, public comments before we move on to uh, the next item? No, there are no public comments at this time. All right. Thank you. So moving on to item number four on our agenda, new business. We have item 4.4, 2021 budget discussion. This is Brad. Normally, in a given year, this is when we'd have our full budget. Uh, I asked this to be placed on the agenda so that we could have the discussion. As many of you know, fourth quarter payments don't come in until after February, so we do not yet have our finals for the 2020 year. Given the circumstances, that does that is more of an important factor than it has been in previous years. Uh, actual versus a estimated. In addition. Um, while the current order was recently lifted, the stay at home order, I'm not comfortable fully looking at our first quarter until we see that as a sustained availability and therefore don't have a very good idea of what our budget would be for first quarter of 2021. Um, and therefore would hold off on a final budget until it is my recommendation that we look at a, uh, the budget again in March. And that would affect uh, items number five, 5.1 and 5.2 as we can, when we get to them, I can share that and my thoughts on how um, reviewing those would be impacted by not having a full budget or not knowing, not ready to go with a full budget based on Q4 of 2020 and Q1 of 2021. All right, thank you, Brad. Uh, any uh, further discussion? All 
Any uh, public comments? There are no public comments at this time. All right, since there are no public comments, we'll move on to, uh, thank you, Brad, by the way. Uh, we'll move on to item five on our agenda, event support applications. And we'll dive right into item 5.1, application for Country Summer Music Festival. So with these and per the discussion of item 4.1 with the budget, as many of you know, in the previous meeting, we did hold off on support, uh, not because we wanted to vote to support or not support, but we were unclear of where our revenues would be and what the overall budget would be available for event support. And again, following up with items 4.0, the uh, 4.1, the budget discussion, still not completely comfortable with what our budget would be and therefore what we would have for the total year of 2021 as far as event support. Um, and also with these events, how, how certain are we with these events going to happen? If we were to tie up funds and they don't happen, that could impact future decisions. So as uh, staff of VSR, I'm recommending, unfortunately, that we would have to hold off and making any decisions at this point until our March meeting. I'd, I'd support that, uh, Brad. I think that uh, in my perspective, it's not a no, it's just a not now uh, kind of a statement, right? Because, uh, you know, who knows if we're going to have uh, events in June. These are great events. You know, there's no no comment about that at all. But um, it, it, there's just so much uncertainty around June uh, right now that it certainly make me a little bit more comfortable if we held off just a little bit longer to try to get some clarity about what the future holds. I would be in favor of that as well. Um, according to the application, it looks like he wants to use the funds for marketing. Um, and I don't think delaying it until March or later would really affect what they want to use the funds for anyways. I don't see them promoting country summer in February. So I, I think we would be okay to postpone. All right, so is that a, a motion on the floor to hold off and then revisit in, 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 in March? So I'm moved. motion to hold off until March and revisit at that point. I'll second. Okay, all those in favor to hold off? Say aye. 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 Okay, any opposed? Any uh, further comments uh, or uh, comments uh, from the general public, please? There are no raised hands at this time. All right, thank you. Moving on to item 5.2 and similar situation here. And I do recall that in September, we um, took a vote to hold this off as well. So this item is the uh, Rock and uh, Revelry Music Festival obligation for event support. Uh, Brett, any comments? The exact same conversation we had for 5.1. Okay. Uh, I'd make the motion to uh, push this one to our uh, future meeting. Okay. Our next meeting. I'll second. All right. All those in favor, say aye. 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 Okay. Any opposed? Okay. Any further discussion? Any public comments? There are no hands raised at this time. Excellent. Thank you, Eileen. All right. So that leads us to item point six, which is adjourning the meeting and um, meeting adjourned. I'll second. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'll see some of you in a little bit uh, at noon, uh, Brad. And uh, good to see you, Todd. Peter, always pleasure. Charlene, Donna. Don't see you, but hope you're doing well. And uh, thank you all very much. Have a good day. Thanks, all. Thank you. Have a good day, everyone.